Good evening. Thanks so much for joining us on this Friday for Queen 6 News at 10. I'm Elizabeth Din. Jeff is off tonight. And tonight, a Portland man accused of rape is arrested. But police now think he may have hurt more people who've just yet to come forward. Our Joelle Jones is digging deeper into this case. And Joelle, why are police concerned that there may be others? Well, Liz, police tell us this arrest was the result of a nearly five year investigation, but they say because the suspect Gabriel Weiss had several aliases and businesses here in Portland, they're concerned there may be more victims, even if they don't know him by this name. The woman responded to the ad thinking that she was going to a modeling job um, and uh, he had other plans. A brutal attack and an arrest nearly five years in the making. Portland police say U.S. Marshals arrested 49-year-old Gabriel Weiss in southeast Portland this morning. He is accused of tying up and sexually assaulting a 19-year-old woman at his Creston Kenilworth home back in August of 2018. The suspect lured the victim to his home on the pretense of a modeling job. And then during the course of that interaction, that's when the assault took place. Um, and it's important for us to let people know what that fact pattern is because he may have done it to others. Court documents show Weiss now faces one count of first degree rape and another count of first degree sodomy for the alleged assault. Police say the victim did not know Weiss personally but responded to an online modeling ad. Because of this and other information found during the investigation, authorities say Weiss may have sexually assaulted others, and they are now asking those with information to come forward. We know he's used multiple names, so people may not know him as Gabriel Weiss. They may know him as something else. Um, and um, so that's one of the reasons we put his photo out there. Investigators say Weiss worked in Portland under the names Kawiri Kaskabal and Gabe Kawiri. In addition to using aliases, police say Weiss taught and ran several local businesses in Portland. His most recent venture, practicing acupuncture at Clinic 11 in Old Town. This is Dr. Gabriel Weiss at Clinic 11. We called the clinic and reached out to employees today, but no one would speak on camera. But with investigators saying a false online ad is what allegedly led the victim and Weiss to cross paths, we asked what safety tips they have for inspiring models or other gig workers. If you can bring someone with you, if you can remain in contact with someone, that can really help um, to make sure that uh, you can judge whether it's legit. Uh, a predator will typically try to isolate the victim. That happened in this case where um, she didn't really have an option to, to get away. Now, Weiss's arraignment is scheduled for next Monday at 2 p.m. And of course, as we said earlier, police are asking anyone with information to contact detectives. We have their contact information listed for you at coin.com. Reporting live in Portland, I'm Joelle Jones, Queen 6 News. Joelle, thank you for that. Just disturbing details there. We do hope authorities will get more information that they need. And now.